Harper wrote this. It's called The First Day of July. Another glorious victory. That's what the headlines in the paper read. Above a photograph of General Hay, standing proud like Caesar, with a garland of fresh laurels on his head. Or if you read the casual figures on the pages just inside, you'd know they paid for Hay's new laurels. 600,000 men had died. I'll not forget that morning, just before the break of dawn. Men lined up in their trenches, all silent and withdrawn. You could feel the fear around you. It was there in every stair. Some lads writing letters home, while others stood in silent prayer. And the sergeant kept their spirits up as we waited in that hole. He said, we've got a lovely morning for it, lads, that this should only be a stroll. And you know there's nothing better for a thirst than a quick walk in the morning air. And I hear they built a lovely pub in the trenches over there. So do it, the Dublin boys, kill every gun you see. And when we take those German trenches, lads, the drinks are all on me. But then the scream of whistles broke the silence. The time of truth had come. And we doubled up the ladder that first morning on the song. They said we took five miles of trenches by noon of that first day. And then the Germans launched a counter and they took our games away. And we struggled to shell holes and scrambled through the wire. You could hear the devil's laughter in the machine guns stuttered fire. For as the dying day lay moaning and the wounded's awful scream, we ran round in blind confusion in a hellish nightmare scene. And as we tried to kick our footsteps through the swampy wet morass, Four generations disappeared in clouds of fire and gas. When Dante wrote of Hades, I wonder if he understood the sight of all those butchered corpses lying scattered in the mud. And men hung up like tattered rags on stretches of barbed wire. The choking taste of mustard gas or the awful squeal of maxim fire. Now I know you think I'm crazy and you say I've got no soul. But there is still out there a suit of air in that dirty, stinking hole. You see, I survived the carnage. It was my heart and soul that died. And I buried them along the song that first morning of July.